are who you are. You love who you are. You like what you do. And you like how you're doing. Now, let me call the first proposer, Honorable Yasmin Abshin. person, the secretary, timekeeper, our lovely chief judge, plus you, the audience. I stand before you to support the motion we already stated on the whiteboard. Should media platforms be banned? Absolutely, yes. It should be banned. Beforehand, I would like to clarify the key words. The definition of media platforms in simple meaning is Media is the main way that a large number of people receive information and entertainment. For example, television, newspapers, internet, and radios. Platform is an opportunity or place for people to express their opinions publicly or make progress, progress in a particular area. We, prop we propose us, we are going to talk about the following points. The highlights, separation of families, wastage of time, cause healthy problems, destruction of future youth, failing exams, laziness, confusion, fast coverage, learning bad habits, cyberbullying, heartbreak, easy spread of wrong information, is comma, increased crime rates, selfishness, promotion of exam practice, replacement of teacher jobs, family neglection, lower self-esteem, bond, love disappointment, culture deviation, dating applications. Me, as Yasmin, I will be talking about the following three, while my colleagues will explain others. First view. Scammers. Many social posts also contain personal information that may seem harmless. The names of children and pets. It's part of every sports team or a birthday. But this detail can help a hacker guess your password or answer common security questions. Hackers also know that people tend to reuse password across accounts. Once they crack one password, they will try on multiple popular websites, from your bank account to your email to see if it works. Second point, dating applications. The biggest disadvantage of these apps is dishonest. You see, they are often individuals who fake their jobs, personality, or, they, or their even existence in totality. It's easy to fake identity and get genuine people to believe on. May you give me two more minutes, please? Thank you. Okay, and get genuine people to believe on an online platform. Individuals on dating apps are often victims of cyber crimes, like bullying and some scams like getting followed when the app shows your location. Where you cross paths with person. Thirdly, and last point, lower self-esteem. The biggest achievement in life is when you know who you are, you love who you are, you like what you do, and you like how you're doing. Like your mistakes, and you love the way you learn from your mistakes. Here what I mean is, many people, especially the young girls and boys, they want to be skinny, rich, pretty, famous, just like the celebrities. They waste all their time copying the celebrities, not knowing that everybody has a different question paper to solve in this life. In conclusion, I would like to inform my fellow boys and girls, let us all focus on our, our education. Let us all run after our dreams. Social media is just destruction. Thanks a lot for listening.